Action. All right, so today we're going to work on the side control escapes. I'm going to give you the most basic elementary escape. Personally, I like the double bicep control, elbow push, who knows that one? Okay. I'm going to teach you guys a basic hip escape that we're going to do. Who knows the hip escape or the heavies that we do when we're come down, we fall. I come in here and we, and we, and we kind of shrimp out. We just do that motion. This is the motion we're going to do today from side control. So Gabe is in side control right here. And he's going to get the best possible grip. He's got the head, the arm control, and my arm is trapped here. A lot of time his chin will be in here, right in here, put it in tight. So I can't even get this hand in here. So when he, he begins to do this, I want you guys just to rock to get this hand in here. You guys see how I did that? You want this hand right here. So once again, if you can't get the hand in here, just, just start to punch, because you'll eventually get the hand right here. Let's go back over here. Okay. Yeah. So I'm going to turn a little bit for guys. Everybody can get see? Mm -hmm. So with my hand in here, this is important. Keep it here. This hand, turn a little bit. I'll turn this way. I want to get it. I want to get it right here and put it on his hip. So I'm in a good position right now. Gabe's still on top of me, but as he squeezes, let's go ahead and squeeze. I still have this hand here. I have a little control. And in here. You don't want this hand out here. This is bad news. You want to get it tucked in here. So the next step, I'm going to put my feet down and three things are going to happen. I'm going to take my right hand. I'm going to push. This is really important. I'm going to lift up on his chin and with my feet, I'm going to hip escape out. So real slow, it's going to look like this. Boom. So I'm out here and from this position, I just bring my knee right back in here, guard recovery. Simple. So back down, six back. How do I get my hand in here when I can? Yeah, you can actually start punching, throwing some punches. And in here, don't do it too crazy, you might get disqualified. So here we go. So this is what it looks. I'm lifting up, you know, in jiu-jitsu you can actually grab it in the gi. So, Push up, push, and we're going to hip out. So it's going to look like this real fast. I'm actually going to, I'm bringing my hips all the way out. Good pressure, pressure. And then I just turn right back in. Just slide it. One more time. So the principal, I remember I had Clayton having a side control one night. And I was exhausted. Man, he's a heavy guy. I got my position in here. Popped his face up, got my hips out. And got back into guard recovery. So as I... Pushed out. So you can see what I did. How I heavied up. Hit up. What do I bring up? Your feet. Just one knee. That's all you need. And he pushes into me. And from here, we can just do the simple guard recovery. One more time. I'll do it fast. So as I, his chin's in here tight, so I begin to bump. Right back in there. Thank you. Pretty simple. Pretty simple. So what you're doing, guys, real quick, as you're here, you're just you're ex you're exploding out. Try to get try to get your body out as far as you can, because here you can just slide the knee right back up the tail. The knee. 